Today I'm standing in front of a unique performance Cobra. It's got a stroker motor in it, beautiful paint job, all customized. You're gonna love checking this one out. Look at this beautiful car. The paint job on it is phenomenal. Those stripes are underneath the clear. All the body work on this fiberglass is impeccable. Look at the body lines on this hood. Cobras don't look that good. <laughs> Man, they're beautiful. And these doors, solid as a rock. These are not the flimsy doors you see on most of these Cobras. These babies are solid as can be. They operate nice. And the bodywork on it, I can't say enough about it. Now the fiberglass is really hard to work with, so somebody spent a ton of time getting this paint work all nice and straight. You can see all the upholstery looks good. See how they took the stripes right inside the um, trunk there. Of course, we got the uh, Cobra style uh, fuel fill. And these doors, I just can't get over how nice these doors are, how nice they open and shut. Take a look at this door panel, beautiful. There's a pocket there to store stuff. Carpeting looks great. The leather on the seats look amazing. We've got a little armrest there with some Cobra sewn in it. The five-speed shifter, the chrome roll bar. Take a look at that dash also. We got Cobras painted inside the gauges. Now all those labels, those come off. Those are just for our guys to know what all the switches do and until you learn what they do and then they peel right off. So those are just temporary. All right, let's go for a ride in this Cobra. She has got a ton of power. This little stroker motor is making an oodle of power, man. <laughs> I love this little car. I'm just barely feathering the uh, accelerator pedal right now. This thing wants to get up and go. Now look down here on the dash. I got my tack here, my speedo. We got oil pressure, water temp, voltage. And then, like I said, all these uh, labels come off gas gauge is over here going through the gears nice we'll see how well the accelerator works here that's about half throttle right there this thing's amazing it's got a ton of power you know what's cool about this is it's loud and obnoxious when you want to be but when you're cruising it's just a nice mellow sound. Great build on this car. And she drives awesome. She rides great. Like I said, the transmission's operating awesome. Here we go. Get to go through the gears again. I'm just barely touching the accelerator and we ran right up to 50 miles an hour. Just like that, man, this thing's sweet. It's not gonna be around long, guys. Jag rear end, stroker motor, unique performance. They specialize in race car Cobras. Here we go. Half throttle, guys. This thing's a beast. All right, we're underneath this unique performance um, Cobra now. She's beautiful. Take a look at this Jag rear end. They've got this extra bracing here to make this thing just as solid as a rock. So when you put all that power to these rear tires, none of this moves. She's great. We've got dual coilovers here holding it up. All the U-joints look good. The rotors look great. It's got the inboard um, disc brakes. The frame is beautifully painted, man. It is absolutely gorgeous. All tubular. Uh, bottom side of the fiberglass uh, floors looks brand spanking new. 
We've got a uh, five-speed trans here. Cast bell housing, beautiful chrome side pipes. All the hardware looks good. All the nuts and bolts are brand new. We've got a great big old aluminum oil pan here. It's a, uh, looks like a Mustang II style front suspension, tubular lower and con upper control arms. Um, of course, coilovers holding it up. Disc brakes up front, they look like Will Woods. Uh, rotors look great. Uh, aluminum radiator here, everything super nice. I mean, they got the radiator hose passing right through the frame here. What a great idea. Front side of the motor's nice and clean. It's a gorgeous Cobra underneath, guys. She looks brand spanking new. Let's look at these wheels and tires. All right, up front here, we've got some Cooper Cobras on this Cobra. <laughs> we've got the uh, Shelby wheels, or the GT40 style wheels. These babies look brand spanking new. Tires look fantastic. Wheel wells are nice and clean. Those chrome side pipes are beautiful. Actually, it looks like these may be polished stainless. Uh, let's look at the rear tires. Out back, we got a bunch of fat meat on the ground here to get some traction. Let's see, we got 295 50 15s. Same good looking, beautiful wheels. Let's get under the hood and take a look at that stroker motor. All right, under the hood here, she is beautiful, all polished up. 347 stroker, it's a small block. Um, it's a mid 80s block, but of course it's been completely built. It's got an air gap intake on it. It's an Endura shine. It looks like March pulley setup on it, aluminum radiator, beautiful Cobra um, valve covers, wireways here for the spark plugs. Everything's nicely painted. We got um, Will Wood set up there on the brakes and the clutch. We got three separate masters. Um, it does have a manual rack on it, um, electric fan on the, uh, rad the aluminum radiator, and take a look at that Cobra under the hood. That is one beautiful job. Uh, we've got a, uh, it looks like a holly carb sitting on top. Uh, it is electric choke, it, um, double pumper, and um, mechanical secondaries. Uh, this Cobra is beautiful, guys. She's set up, ready to go, super high quality, 